Hello guys, welcome to Architectural World. Welcome back. Today we're going to be learning how to create wall extras, like window beds. That's what we're going to be learning today. How to create a window bed. Let me show you how to create this bed. How to create this bed in our 3D modeling. You can see this is a bed and this is a bed. This are uh, for the toilet window and this is for the main building. Let me take you around. This is what we're going to be learning how to create today. So sorry for the long break. And please don't forget to subscribe to our channels. And don't forget to dive into our channel page so you see all our amazing classes. So today, we're going to be learning how to create window wall extra. It's called wall extra. So you can call it window bed or wall extra. So let's quickly dive into the class. Now, before you create uh, a window, a window bed let's go into the class okay okay this is what we want to create this is what we want to create let me take this off at the lead let me go to toilet then I delete now I want to create wall extra on this and this what you need to do is go to objects you come to the setting that along here you activate it you can type in words you can just type in words and type in wall extra it's going to prompt out what you want you look for it okay you can see we have glass panel we have this uh ashitrava o1 or this depend on the design i like using the plain one so i'm going to choose this i'll choose this i'll come down to okay then i'll set this from here now the next thing you want to consider here is the length the length and height of your window okay take it for example now if i place this here if i place this here let me rotate it very well so you see it if i place this here okay you can see that it matches 1.2 meter that's because I, i'm using 1.2 meter on this window let's see it on 3d okay let's go down to 3d let's go down to 3d let me look for what i just created okay okay now look at what i just created you see that there is much space here there is much space here and it's even similar because i've already have it on my design so when you're creating this wall extra what you need to consider first your major concern should be the height of your main window and the, the width of your window now let's check the height of this window here you can see i have the width of 900 and i have the the, the height of 1130 then I have cheat to silly one one zero zero. So what I'm going to be working with is just this two. Let's take for example that I come to this spot. Then I I put here one one three zero. You see, check it out. One one three zero. You can see very well we have it here. Then you come to this spot. I change this height. I change this height to one one three zero okay okay you can see it's dropping down you can see it very well it's dropping down so if i want this thing to go down I'll put here cheat to seal it now you can see it fits in perfectly it fits in perfectly you can see it very well it fits in perfectly so whenever you want to create your wall extra first you need to consider the, the height of the window you consider the height of the window and the width of the window now let's go to the this toilet let's go to this toilet okay i already have i already have a wall here i'll come to my object it's already on the wall too but i'll just come down to this spot i'll pick it up i'll rotate okay i think the rotation is okay then let me place this so you can see very well let me rotate it so you see it I drag it to this spot. I place it here. Okay, let's see it on a 3D. 
you can see very well that on our 3d this is a smaller window and this wall extra here is big so we have to move this wall extra to fit in this now what you do you click your window so you can be able to check the the width then you check the the height then you check the seal to story if this been done you click this you put in the command we have the height of 500 we have the height of 500 okay then we have bottom offset to 1530 that's what i'm using on my window so i don't know what you're using on your window that's what you're using on your window we have a height of 700 so you have to work according to your window design they will come to this spot we'll, we'll go to the width of 500 now let's check it out we have the width of 500 if you check very well you see that this thing has fitting perfectly but there is a gap here that's because it has changed alignment from the story so you come down to your story you can see it very well i'll click then all i need to is move it to the spot i want it okay let's check it on our 3d you can see perfect so if whenever you want to create your wall extra you can see it very well we have it right where we want it so when you're creating your wall extra always put the the height the width and uh, the tree to silly of the window it's very very necessary it's very necessary please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to turn on the notification button so you don't miss out our amazing class